Yo, what is up everybody? Jumping here and I'm back with some destiny. Oh yeah. So in this episode, we're going to try to complete the rest of the moon. There's only two missions left. We have the final mission and then we have the strike mission. And I guess I'll do the strike mission. We'll see. I don't know. Maybe I might want to wait to do all the strike missions and show them off with like a group of friends and do like a three-way commentary or something. I don't know. Because if I do it by myself, I'm gonna have to play with randoms. Urgent transmission incoming on all channels from the speaker. Nothing is more important now. We believe the Hive are engaged in a ritual that is draining the Traveler of its light. Whatever power they wield must be understood and destroyed. Oh shit! All right, let's freaking do this. Already. This ritual could be happening in any one of their thousands of chambers. If we can find cracks deep enough, I can map the entire hive fortress. All right, so I'm gonna be using a couple different weapons in this episode. I'm gonna try to like mix it up to show off all the different kind of weapons. Right now, I have a scout rifle on, and I really love this scout rifle and a fusion rifle. So you guys can kind of see like the two. Um, okay, good scan, but. Not enough to locate the ritual yet. Let's keep looking. All right, Tyrion. But yeah, so I'll be able to show off what what a scout rifle can do because the scout rifles are really good if you can get headshots. I mean, they're really really good, and the fusion rifles are super fun, especially in campaign. I don't really know how I feel about them in multiplayer because I tried them in the beta, and I normally would get wrecked, but that could just be me. I mean, I don't know. All right, I think we can get off here. Where is this thing? Oh, it's right over there. There's probably some enemies over here, too. Let's go. So, basically, we're scanning some cracks so that we can find, like, um, I guess where the hive is or where their leader is or whatever it might be. Oh, shit, I'm getting shot at. Fucking bitch. Fuck. See that headshot? I got it. Basically, if you can hit headshots with this, look at that. Look how much damage you can do. It's insane. The scout rifle is basically like a sniper rifle. I mean, that's the best way to put it. I mean, it's not as strong as a sniper rifle, but you can one-shot a lot of different enemies when you have a decent scout rifle. And the fusion rifles, man. Oh, God. They are very powerful. You can do a shit ton of damage to big enemies. One shot generally will take down the shields of a enemy, and then the second shot should kill it. I mean, it's that good. Alrighty. So, I guess we're just going to go this way until we make it to where we have to go. I don't know how far this is exactly, but it could be kind of far. I'm really excited to beat the moon because I really want to start Venus because remember I haven't actually played any of Venus yet I've only done the moon and earth so once I get to Venus it will be like all new shit I haven't seen so any reactions will be legitimate where on the moon I already know like what has happened so it's not like anything's gonna come out of somewhere Someone's and surprise me content. you know could be the speaker oh shit Let's get out in the open. I'll have a better chance of blocking this signal. Alright, so if you guys remember this place, this is where we were in the first mission on the moon, and we got the cutscene where we got to see the mysterious person. It was like a hunter. And now we're gonna get another cutscene. You're interesting. Not entirely interesting, but you have promise. Who is that? I don't know. I'm losing the signal. Guardian, I know what you're about to do. It's brave. But there are enemies out here you would not believe. Out where? Go down and face the hive. And if you live, come find me. 
Signal dropped. I got some broken coordinates. Venus, Northern Hemisphere. Ishtar region. Great. What do we do now? We go down. Yeah, we about to go kick some ass. Alrighty. Freaking loading screens, though. I can't stand them. Oh shit, ogre! We got an ogre! Oh no! Fuck you! Eat the nade! Ooh, damn, that was a good amount of damage. Let's use the fusion rifle. See what I'm talking about? Holy fuck! Fusion rifle is just ridiculous. Absolutely crazy, look. Bam, one shot. What up? Bam, one shot. I got an upgrade too. This is a blue fusion rifle. That's a knight. One, two. I mean, it's fucking crazy good! Love the fusion rifle. Probably my favorite secondary weapon for campaign. It might turn out to be my favorite in multiplayer too, but the problem in multiplayer is that by the time it takes to like charge this shit up, you might like get murdered. I have a challenge too right now I need to complete where I have to kill two enemies with one blast 20 times, which is definitely not that easy. Let's go ahead and upgrade this gun though. Let's see what we can get. Okay. Kills with this weapon grant bonus damage. Hell fucking yeah. I mean, that's like an amazing upgrade. Super easy to get, you know. Boom. Kill, kill an enemy, and then the next shot's gonna do more damage. And as long as you keep killing enemies, you're gonna keep getting more damage with it. Oh, uh, shit. It's probably a waste using it on those guys. Alright. Hey, how you doing? Eat the nerd! Oh shit, there's a wizard. Let's supercharge this shit up. What up? What up? What up? I have another challenge too right now where I have to kill three enemies with my supercharge 20 times. So that's basically 20 supercharges. Alright. We got a knight. We're gonna blast this fool. What up? Oh man, the reload speed on this thing's good. Aww. Ooh, this is, oh, that was perfect. I don't know how many I got with that blast, but it looked like I got maybe three, maybe four. Would have been crazy if I got four. Oh shit! All right, line it up. Okay, we gotta line it up. Yeah! That is amazing. So, right now, campaign-wise, I would say my two favorite... Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Eat that. My two favorite, like, um, weapon classes, which, unfortunately... I'm just gonna kill this guy with the scout rifle. Unfortunately, my opinion, my opinion might change every video. Because, generally, when I first start playing the game, I'll say that shit a lot. And some people will point that out, and they think it's funny... Or they just think it's stupid where I'll say basically like oh man this is like my favorite gun I love this gun it's my favorite thing in the world and then like the next video I'm like no man this is like my favorite gun this is the, fit this is the best thing in the world you know it's broken it's overpowered it's amazing <laughs> so I'm really inconsistent so keep that in mind guys um, if you don't know that by now with me oh okay well let's supercharge it up all right, wizard. Eat that. Eat that. Aw, I should have actually aimed for a weak enemy since I'm trying to go for that challenge. Hello. Oh, fuck. Multiple knights. Oh, we're running out of ammo with this fusion rifle. I need to, like, be a little bit more conservative with it. Let's get some ammo back. Fuck you, dude. Die. Oh, you know what? I do believe I have a blue hand cannon. I might... No, I don't, actually. Never mind. I thought I had a blue hand cannon. Because I really do want to try out the hand cannons. I haven't actually really used them since the game. Since I've actually been playing the real game. In the beta, I tried them. I didn't like them, but... 
They might be a lot different in the real game, so I need to try them out. Sometime soon, when I get a hand cannon, I will be using it, so... Like I said, I'm gonna be trying to show off all the different weapon classes, and, um... I'll tell you what I think of them. Alright, let's see if we can get multiple... Hell yeah, I got three of them with that blast. Oh, here we go. Let's try to get multiple again. Ah! <laughs> oh god, it's so good! It's so fucking good! Alright, come on. Eat that! Eat that! Eat that! God, love it. Alright. Looks like we gotta come down this way. Oh, the door is closed. Here it is. The darkest of all the hive's chambers. Well, that's not good. Oh, shit. There's like three wizards here. Screw you. If you have like, if you have like good timing and decent aim, that's what makes it, I think, it's so good. I think if you were like really bad and you had really shitty aim or your timing wasn't very good, you probably would not like the fusion rifles all that much. Damn. All right, yo, we got to go for this. Multiple kills. Let's go. Urgh. Multiples. Oh, round of ammo. No. I need more. Ooh. Give me more ammo. Hella ammo. Oh, shit. Eat that. Ah. Let's get back up top. Let's go ahead and supercharge it. Ah! Gotta get another kill. Come on, come on, come on. Got it. Oh, where am I getting shot from? <clears throat> Die! Alright. Here we go. Eat this! Line it up. Yeah. All right, we got multiples coming again. Die. Whoa. Whoa. There's a green weapon over there. I want it. Oh, shit. Not good. Fusion rifle broken, man. That, that's all I have to say. And I know I've said it like a thousand times, so I need to really just shut up. I'm sure I'm annoying you guys by now, but... Oh, that was a fail. Oh, look, another green. Hell yeah. Some gloves. Well, that was easy. Oh, no, it's not over yet. Uh-oh. Not over! Holy fuck! Oh wow, they all died. That's kind of weird. That always happens though. At least I always notice that. If you kill like the boss, all the other enemies, that they'll just drop dead. It's like, what? How did that happen? I guess it can kind of make sense with the hive because maybe they are like a hive, you know? You kill the queen or the boss, whatever, and they all don't know what to do and they just die. I don't know. Friends said there are enemies on Venus worse than this. Great. Well, son of a bitch. Alrighty. That is what's up. Now we have to sit here and wait for like 20 seconds. I guess we go on a dance, dance, yeah. It's so funny how the robots they do the fucking robot. Yeah. Ho -ho. Yeah. Salute. What up? Point. 
normally when I'm playing with people, I always like try to find like a really badass spot to just sit down. Like you know, yeah, I did my job. Now I'm just gonna rest and wait for pickup. Alrighty. See what we get. Anything special? Oh, just some boots. All right. I think I'm gonna actually head over to the tower, so I'm gonna cut this ahead because I need to check out like all my new stuff and see if there's anything good. I'll let you guys know though if I get anything good. All right, I'll see you guys in a moment. Alrighty, so now let's go do the strike mission, and then in our next episode we will definitely go and start Venus. So I'm really excited to actually get going. Alright, unfortunately we have to play with some randoms, which is fine, I don't really mind, but, you know, the only problem is, is that if I get really unlucky and I get some randoms that don't know what they're doing, this mission's gonna be a lot harder, that's for Something sure. Something dark stirs in the depths of the Hellmouth. We can feel it. A hive abomination bred for unthinkable evil. We must pierce the veil of their summoning pits and destroy this creature before the hive unleash it upon us all. All right, that does not sound good. That does not sound good. Basically, all the strike missions are raid missions. We have to go and kill a giant boss, basically. And that's, that's really all it is, but... It is fun, and it's the best way to get gear, so keep that shit in mind. Fucking go. What up? Fuck up these enemies. Man, I'm running into a wall. Oh, baller. Whoa. What the hell happened there? Get on somewhere, bitch! Got nothing on me. Alright, so we're gonna keep pushing forward. Now, there is a golden chest I do know about at the end of this mission. I'll try to point it out. There's no telling how far down we'll have to go to find the summoning pits. Alright. But yeah, I'll try to point out where the golden chest is if you guys don't know. Oh, shit. Eat that. Die. Oh, I didn't die from that. Oh man, I'm in the fucking wizard's thing. That's not good. Blank this fool. Man, that guy has a sniper rifle that's shooting hella fast. Oh man, I'm in the poison again. Alright, let's fucking rock. Pretty sure we're coming up on a... Yeah, this part right here is kind of a pain in the ass. We need to get through. I'll try to open that gate. Basically, what this is, is this is a... One of those moments, you know, you gotta hack the door and fight enemies. I think one of our fucking people quit. See, that's what I'm talking about. Fucking socks. Life. Life, life. Eat that and die. And I missed. Alright, I want to get multiple shots off if I can. Nah. Oh shit. No, 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 no. Ah! Fuck off! Damn it. Alright, well, we're just gonna kill him normal. I'm gonna need ammo. Oh, there's a knight, dude. Watch out. What with that guy's playing as? His melees are hella strong. Oh, he didn't die, did he? Don't die, bro. Oh, I'm out of ammo. Hang tight. Oh, shit. Load our heavy up. Just in case we might need it. Eat that! Come on, bro. Oh, I know. I see what he's using. He's using a... He's using a scout rifle, too. I just... I thought that was a sniper rifle. Cause it sounds so weird. Oh, I'm out of ammo. Shit. Oh, not good. Surrounded by knights. Not good at all. Ah! Fuck! 
Oh god, there's a wizard too. Alright, I need my health to hurry up and come back. Eat that. Eat that. Eat that. Don't worry, bro. I got you back. Oh shit. No, no, no. I need help. I walked right in that poison. Shouldn't be long. Man, where is some green ammo at? Get my fusion rifle going again. Oh shit. Watch yourself. Watch yourself! Oh, is he dead? Shit, he's dead. Fuck, fuck, fuck! Not good. See? Oh god, and now I'm dead. Oh, we're gonna fail. Keep yourself alive, man. See, this is what happens when you play these strike missions with randoms. You'll have somebody quit or something, and then it just becomes a bitch for everyone else. Thank you, bro. Now run! Run! Ah! Fuck you, die. These are heavy. Oh, yeah, you can do that too, that's fine. Oh, God! First piece of shit. There we go, finally! Finally! Alright, what's going on here? Oh, God! Not good. Oh, hell yeah. Eat this and die. And I think we are good to go. Alright, let's hurry up and upgrade, though. Got it. The gate's opening. Alright, what is this? Keyhole. Hell yeah. That's a good power. I'm pretty sure it lets you uh, penetrate like through enemies with Golden Gun. So that's really awesome. Ups my defense on the arms. The blue items in this game are fucking awesome. So I can imagine that the purple items and then eventually if there's legendary items. I've heard that there are legendaries like golds or oranges or something. And yeah, I can imagine they're going to be broken. Just so many effects on them, you know what I'm saying? Like, so that's going to be fucking awesome. Alright. So there's like, um... Two pretty strong enemies over here. An ogre and a knight. Fuck you, ogre. Come on, man. Let me push up. I'm gonna fucking blast this fool. Oh, fuck. Alright, good. He's dead. And I think we can just keep pushing forward. Yeah, this is gonna be a total bitch when we get to the actual boss with just two people, but Sounds like we're getting closer. as long as this guy is somewhat smart, it won't be that hard. Hey, somebody joined! Alright! I didn't even know people could do that. But that is freaking awesome that people can actually join your squad if somebody quits. Alright, we need to go this way. It's gonna be enemies. Take that! Fucking knight. Alright, we're supercharged. And I think I'm gonna use it too. Let's go. Die, knight. You know what would be really easy? To get that one challenge where you have to kill three enemies with supercharge, I would imagine being the warlock would probably be the best thing for that. Oh shit. Alright, there's our third. Awesome, he caught up. I guess he probably spawns in by us. Oh shit, I'm going the wrong way. No, not that way. Don't follow me, man. Right, I'm gonna push up with my fusion rifle. What? You didn't die one hit? Alright, he didn't die either one hit. That shit is wild, dude. Like, people are just jumping through the air, meleeing those wizards and kicking their asses. That's awesome. Oh shit! Fucking die! Got him. I know there's another knight. Oh, there he is! Oh, got your back, bro. All right, so I'm pretty sure this is the boss. 
Yeah, it's like right here. Just gotta let the door open up. All right, now I'll show you what I like to do for this, like my little strategy, because I've done this with a couple of my friends a couple times. But um, first of all, I like to actually start off by just killing some of the enemies, clearing them out, because the guy's all locked up, like just like the other one. It seems like all the strike bosses might be locked up when you first enter. There's gonna be a whole shit ton of enemies, so like I said, I recommend actually taking the time, killing as many of the enemies as you can, and then I'll show you where I like to stand. Also, I guess I could probably show you where the golden chest is real quick. Take that! That was a horrible nade. Man, I'm getting shot from fucking everywhere. Alright. The golden chest spawns like right here where I'm looking now. It's, it's down on this platform. Alright, so there's a rock over here I really like. This rock right here. Love that rock. Kicks a lot of ass. Alright, is this boss out yet? Yes, he is. Alright, now his weakness, or his weak spot is his, his belly. So aim for his belly. And so far, this is looking pretty good. Because, like, when you fight these kind of bosses like this, you kind of want to spread out. See how, like, that guy's over there on that side, and we got one guy all the way back at the beginning? That's actually really good what we're doing here. We recommend saving your... Whoa! Saving your overcharge. Because you're gonna have shit like this come. Whole fucking bunch of shit. And yeah, you're gonna wanna use it. On the knights and shit. And wizards that will come to try to get you. So, we need to basically try to clear out anything that comes to us. And then get back to the boss. Oh man, there's more shit. Eat the nade! Man, I got so much shit around me right now. Man, everything wants me fucking dead! Oh, there's the knight, okay. Fuck! Fuck, I'm getting shot at from fucking everywhere, man! What the fuck? Why is all the enemies spawning by me? Give me a break. Yeah, I knew something was behind me. I haven't really had a chance to even really shoot at the boss because I keep fucking have to fight off all this other shit that keeps coming over here. Uh oh. Not good. Yeah, but use the rock for cover. Try to pay attention to your radar, too, because if they do spawn, like, to your right, or be sometimes they can even spawn behind you over here. But if they do spawn, if you're just paying attention, you should have no problem. Oh, fuck. When these guys come, it's not a big deal. You just melee these fools. They normally die one hit from melees. Alright, fuck. See, like, that's the problem. Like, those two guys standing over there, that's actually an issue for me. Because it really leaves me just totally exposed. Where it'd be better to have one guy also kind of over here with me. Or on the other side. Just to throw him off. Alright, one guy's coming over here. Shit. And there's a drop ship coming. That's not good. That's really not good. I'm about to die too if I'm not careful. Basically, we're about to have enemies come. So it's time to just start trying to blow shit up. I think that might have been enough. Man, we're totally running out of ammo, but whatever. I mean, yeah. This is bad, man. Can't get any shots off on the boss. Sometimes, like, this shit can take, can go by really quick when everyone is focusing down the boss. Other times, it takes fucking more forever because people, yeah, see, see, like, that guy over there, he's, he's just, he's in a bad spot. He's just surrounded by shit, so he's not able to really pay attention to the boss at all. 
And now I'm gonna have to fucking start fighting these guys because they're chasing them over to me. Fuck am I getting? Oh, I'm dead. Oh, I see. Asshole above me, man. Thank you. All right. Well, that's not good. Oh shit, there's a wizard. I would totally want to kill this guy fucking above me because he keeps shooting down at me and really screwing me over. Where's the boss at? A sniper rifle would probably be pretty good for like this. Ah, fuck. Oh, fuck. Okay, that's really not good. No special ammo. I'm dead. Oh, god damn it. See what happened right there? That knight either fell down from the top or he spawned right there. I mean, honestly, it would probably be best for us just to respawn with the timer because the guy over there, if he tries to come and get us, that's just suicide. It's kind of, it's kind of like Mass Effect. If everyone's down... Sometimes it's best not to actually run in to try to save everyone because Well, you're just gonna die, you know, you're gonna get screwed over See oh look at this shit. Look at this shit. Oh my god See this is what you don't do and this is what people can't understand It really makes me mad in a way you don't stand in this doorway If you stand in this doorway, this is what happens. You can't get out Look at this shit And these enemies are just gonna keep spawning back here so you're just fucked like what I'm gonna have to do is kill the enemies and just run out and run for it and hope not to get blown up or killed Oh shit, okay, that's not good. I know one of my teammates is down right here by me, but You know, it's just I guess I'll go get him. Come on. Let's get him. Let's get him Get out of the fucking room dude just back the hell up for now. I'm running out of ammo. See, like this is what you get for playing with randoms though when you play with friends and you actually kind of like you talk about what to do You uh, this is a lot easier like I was beating this mission yesterday. It was taking us about 10 minutes We were, we were just flying through it. It was super easy Okay, I'm just getting out of here man. I can't it's impossible to get out of here like we're just fucked We're fucked like, look at that. Like, we killed all those wizards and shit. And, and like, fucking now there's a, they're all back. Fuck you, thing. Unfucking real, man. I'm just running. I'm just going. See ya. See ya, fuckers. Fuck off, all of ya. Unfucking believable. It looks like one of our teammates is not even playing. I'm running out of ammo, too. <sighs> yeah, nice. Give me ammo. Thank you. Fuck. Stop spawning by me. I think I'm going to move again. I think I'm going to go all the way around. I don't know what my teammates are doing now. If they're just sitting back in that room fighting endless enemies. Or are they actually going to try to, you know, get out of there? That's really what you need to do. Oh, shit. Oh, here comes the wizard. Oh, shit. Oh, no. Not good. Double not good. Triple not good. Oh, no. Run away! I really need to kill this wizard if I can. Oh, did I really just kill that thing? Alright, good. Let's go get these wizards. What up, wizard? Die. Where's your buddy at? Oh, shit. There's an enemy right behind me, isn't there? Ah, oh, that's a wizard right behind me. <sighs> oh, 
Unfucking real, man. This is the hardest I've ever had doing this mission. Come on, reload this shit. And I still have a full team. That's the craziest part. You know, I got a full team, but like, it's like nobody is leaving that room or something. Like, come on, guys, get out of there. Cause, like, am I the only one who's gonna end up killing this boss? So I'm gonna move over here again and hope I don't get wrecked. Fuck you. Ah, uh, slowly but surely he's dying, you know. We might keep getting rushed by shit and all that, but whatever. I don't even care anymore. This is why I really should have not have decided to do the strike mission without friends. I knew that this was going to happen where I was going to get screwed over by my teammates. I thought that these guys were decent at first. Like, they, they were doing all right in the beginning of the mission. But the second we get to the boss, they don't know what to do. Is that guy level one? That guy's level one. Oh, shit. Okay, so that might be a problem. It looks like somebody joined that was on his friends list. No, that's a level 15. Okay, I don't know why it was saying level 1. I thought it, maybe it was first player or something. And I'm just tripping. Unfucking real. I mean, it's gonna keep fucking poking out and shooting him. I mean, eventually he'll fucking die. Actually, I should probably start fusion rifling him. Yeah, that's good damage. I need to kind of save this, though, if I get surrounded by bigger enemies. Ah, oh, see, they're above me, too. It's just, they can't hit me from the top if I'm standing here. Oh shit, they're not spawning next to me, are they? You know, for an ogre, or whatever this thing is, you would think he would, like, actually try to run up and melee you. He never gets out of the middle. It's really strange. Finally, it looks like my teammate's actually shooting at him. This is going to be one long fucking episode. Let's get a little bit closer. Back up. Fuck you, dude. I mean, it's the same shit over there. I mean, they haven't left that room. Like, they're just surrounded by wizards and shit. Might be kind of a good thing for me because I haven't really had to deal with any enemies in a while. So that's kind of good. Because at least if I, if I can shoot them and do damage to them, then hopefully he'll die eventually. Fuck, I did not mean to just waste that last shot. Run out of ammo again, though.
Turn around, bitch! Shoot at me! That'd be all cool. Oh no! Ah, oh, god damn it! Where's the other teammate at? Oh, this guy needs to be careful. Just to wait for us to respawn. Cause I mean, he's almost dead. If, he, if we all die now, I'm gonna fucking quit. I wonder, is that, oh wow, I spawned back here, awesome. I wonder, has he been doing that this whole time? Where he's just like crouching in that corner. Or it's just because we were dead. Maybe that's what it was. I don't know, guys. Alright, he's dead. Final fucking lay! Finally, the abomination yeah, has been Tyrion. The Vanguard will be grateful. A no, do not dance with me, motherfucker. Fuck off. And our world spared another <sighs> I need a fucking rest after that shit. Still out there, growing among the darkness. I fear we may find out all too soon. All right, guys. Well, that was absolutely ridiculous. That was probably the worst strike mission I've ever done. I don't know why it was so freaking hard. Well, actually, I do know why it was hard. It was because those guys, I don't know what the hell they were doing. I really don't. There was, in the beginning, it looked like everything was going well. Like, you know, people knew what to do, spread out. But then, like, boom. It's like, uh-uh. Nope. No spreading out. Oh, I got a fucking gun. Awesome. It's like, oh, just skip in the room. Yay. All right, I'm actually going to check out that gun. I got a blue heavy weapon. It might be a rocket launcher. Come on, come on, come on. Let's see. Oh, nice. Level 10. Um, yeah, it's a rocket launcher. Yeah, that's cool, though. I'm down with that. 14. All right. What is this? Ah, uh, strength. Fuck that. Although, that would be really good. Fusion rifles and auto rifle ammo. I like that. Anyway, guys, I really hope you have enjoyed this. If you have, will you please like and favorite the video for me? Be sure to subscribe if you haven't. And I hope everyone has a very nice day. And poo so.